good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Hello to all of you. So here I am again, Love JL. And for today's video, I just want to show you around the house that I've been living for almost four years here in Doha, Qatar. Because in just a few weeks, I shall be leaving this home. Yes, because we need to be relocated to another building. So. Please join me and let's make this one last memory. Hello again everyone! So before I begin with this flat tour, let me just share some few things about this building. So I think this building was built like two years before we came because we were told that it was occupied first by pilots and then I don't know what happened they just decided to give it to cabin crew to us so yeah and then we were a big batch there's like three batches of us and this building was already vacated so they put us all together here so my flatmates are my batch mates. So it's just an easy adjustment. And I guess that's it for now. So let's begin with the door. So now we are at the entrance. I just came from the main door. So in the entrance, I've set up like a, I have here a sanitizer, tissue, and because I always forget whenever I leave. So this is like a reminder to take my mask and gloves and I also have a witch hazel toner here. I spray this one on my mask before wearing it so it will prevent me on having pimples. And when COVID started, I also became a blanquita. <laughs> so here is our flat. It's quite big, right? And here is our living room. Yes, we barely use this one because we are more comfortable to be in our own rooms. And it's quite very dusty in here. Yes. We also have a balcony. But yeah, we don't use that one as well. And we can no longer open the door because, I don't know, maybe it's because of the dust, it got stuck already. And if I really need to use the sofa, I need to cover it first with blankets. So, hindi ako ma... magangati sa ano, alikabok. So, we also have our sampayan there, but whenever we need to use that one, we just set it up here. So, at least our clothes will get its sun rays from here. Let me show you our neighborhood. It's very peaceful in here. It's all just residential buildings. And just right over there is the metro station. So it's an Kembot. And let me show you as well some of my plants. Puro lang siya snake plants dahil madali lang alagaan ang snake plants. So, binili ko lang siya itong last month. Hinayaan ko muna siya dyan kasi nga nalaman ko lilipat din kami. So, hindi ko na siya ni-fort ang hanapan kung saan ko siya ilalagay. And here is some contacts, food and grocery, deliveries. And eto ang punto. Nagmamayari nito ay yung batchmate ko sa kabilang flat. Kasi hindi na aarawan sa flat nila. So, dito daw muna para maarawan. And, itong dining area namin, I think, ako lang gumagamit nito. Ay, hindi. Hindi naman. Pero, mas madalas ako. And, yung isa kong flatmate. And, here we have common toilet. Here is our kitchen. So of course, because we get to travel a lot, we have some fridge. 
magnet collections here. So, I think mostly yung nandito ay akin kasi yung kanila yung uuwi nila sa bahay nila. So, hindi na ako masyado nag-stock up ng food dahil in just a few weeks, lilipat din naman. So, para iwas din ng bit-bitin. Mag-grocery na lang ako once nakalipat na ako. So, ayan. Ito, hati-hati lang kami. Ito sa kanya, yung isa. Tapos, ito yung sa akin. Diyan na area. And then, naglay ako ng upuan dito kasi kapag nagluluto ako, napapagod ako. And I cannot stay in my room while cooking kasi makakalimutin din ako. So, masusunod yung food. So, kailangan ko mag-stick talaga dito sa kusina habang nagluluto. At ayun, ang aming kapitbahay. <laughs> so, ngayon, actually, mag-isa lang ako dito kasi it's been 10 months already nung nag-start yung travel ban. So, this is my room. This is my flatmate room. Room C and room B. So, na-stuck sila outside. So, hindi pa rin sila makabalik hanggang ngayon. Kaya mag-isa ako dito for 10 months for rent. So, this is our laundry area. So, kung papansin nyo, no, so, hindi maayos yung washing machine namin. Kasi hindi talaga siya kadikit sa floor. So, whenever we use this one, naglalakad siya. Maabot siya hanggang dito sa may pintukan. At inuuntog niya na rin yung sarili niya sa pin. <laughs> Then here is like a small storage room. Pakita ko pa ba? Sige. Nagulo siya. Ayan. Wala nang masyadong... <laughs> Puro lang tambak ang makikita nyo. So in our flat, we have four rooms. But as per regulation, it should only be occupied by three people. So itong... Fourth room, room D, extra room lang siya dito. At ginawa na rin namin siyang storage area. It has its own toilet as well, but there's no bottom. So, ayan. Ito gamit ko ng flatmate ko. Ito gamit ko din. <laughs> Mga hindi na nagigamit na sapatos, luggages, and all this stuff. So, ito yung din niya. This one is a hotel. Actually, kahit nung nandito rin naman yung mga ka-flatmate ko, parang mag-isa lang din ako dito kasi lagi rin silang wala. <laughs> and here is my room. That is my dresser. Napakagulo. My king size bed. Cabinet. My shoe area. My luggages. My trolley for work. My meditating area. Ring light for vlog and syempre, Pinoy na Pinoy electric pan kahit na may aircon dahil laking electric pan. <laughs> <laughs> At ayan yung view ko outside. Another residential building. It's itong window ko, medyo tinakpan ko siya para ano, slightly privacy kasi tingin ko ako ng kapitbahay. And then, ayan, ang aking mga collection pa, snow globes. Medyo pinaproblema ko ngayon paano ko siya ipapak dahil tinapong ko yung mga boxes and oh my bed, it's almost 4 years for the two of us. Mami miss kita. <laughs> and here is my toilet. So medyo magulo siya. Hindi ko masyado papakita. Ayan, I have my own bathtub. Actually, itong rooms namin, yung akin, yung B at C, lahat kami may sariling toilet at bathtub. So, yeah. I just don't know if magkakaroon pa rin kami sa lilipata naming building. At hindi rin namin alam kung magkakasama pa rin kami. Anyways, a new year, a new house, a new beginning, and a new hope. So, Thank you for watching. Please do subscribe and like this video and share it as well to your friends. Thank you.
Thank you very much. Mac and cheese! Actually, ayoko muna sana magpak ng gamit kasi ayoko makita yung flat namin na wala na masyado. Gamit? Wala na ng tao, wala pang gamit. Nakakalungkot tingnan. And I still have 18 more days to go. I still have a lot of time. And I only have one flight before move out. Should I pack or should I not? <laughs> Ayaw ko makakita ng boxes. Hmm. Siguro pa ko na lang muna yung mga winter clothes, winter shoes, yung mga gamit na hindi ko naman talaga nagagamit pa ngayon. Better days. Saka 
sana nandito ang aming mga rooms. Dalawa lang kami dito. And then sa kaliwa, andito ang aming kitchen and living room. So, ito na tayo sa kitchen. Itong akin fridge. Pero yung ka-flat ko, andito yung fridge niya sa sala. So, okay na din na maghiwalay kami ng fridge. So, ito lang. Ito lang yung kitchen namin. Very small lang siya. Ito na rin yung laundry area namin. At syempre, ang um, ano, bumubuhay sa akin ngayon ang aking mahiwagang air fryer. So, ayun yung cabinets namin. Actually, masyadong mataas yung cabinet. <laughs> Lutuan, oven. Gusto yung makita naman ng ref ko. Syempre, mga ano lang, pang-prito. <laughs> Oh, madaling lutuin. Tapos, madaling kainin lang din. Yogurt. <laughs> Ayan. O, oh, diba? Overlooking ang ano, ang sala. So, ang problema lang dito sa kitchen namin, kapag gusto mong i-open tong door, yung cabinet dito natatakpan. Pero super bait naman ng ka-flat ko. Kinuha niya na yan kasi nauna siya sa akin nito bago ako dumating. So, pinigay niya na sa akin itong madaling gamitin na cabinet. Pero okay din naman dito sa kitchen namin. May door. So, pag nandun siya, natutulog. So, ako nasa kusina. Pwede ko siyang i-close. Tapos, pwede na ako mag-ingay dito sa <laughs> kitchen namin. O kaya, kung siya naman, kailangan magluto at ako ang natutulog. So, hindi niya ako na i-store po. Sala, sa aming dining table na parang wala namang gumagamit. Dahil pareho lang din naman kami nagkukulong sa kwarto. Ito na ang aking mga ano, snake plants. Ang mini balcony. Madilin na sa labas. Hindi ko na ipakita. Ang sala na wala naman din gumagamit. <laughs> At ito, nakikita niyo ba ang aking kitty? Dahil sa likod niyan, dito yung mga tambak ko pang boxes. May pakototo din ako kapag unpack. Pati yun, sa akin din na box yan. Hindi ko rin pa siya na-unpack. Wala akong plano mag-unpack. Ito, common toilet, pero puro din siya gamit ko. Akin yun, akin yun. At itong mga kalad yun, akin yun. Hehehe. <laughs> kwarto niya at ito naman ang kwarto ko. Ang aking bed, cabinet, at itong puan na to. Actually, gusto mo na siya itago ulit sa box dahil hindi ko naman siya gagamit. pa ako nakakapag-ayos ng gamit ko. Marami pa akong gamit na nasa loob ng boxes at wala akong planong ilabas. <laughs> Ahaya ako na muna siya sa boxes. Ayan lang naman. Maliit lang ng loob ko pero sakto lang siya. Bye Pikachu!